do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hey friends in the last lecture we have studied that what are redox reaction and what are the types of redox reaction and now we are going to learn about the type of redox reaction number 4 that is disproportionation reaction so let us see what is this so the disproportion uh, so the disproportionation reaction is nothing but in this reaction an element in one oxidation state is simultaneously oxidized as well as reduced in a chemical reaction so let me give you an example uh, like uh, the hydrogen peroxide that is 2 times h2o2 is been decomposed into 2 times of h2o that is water plus oxygen molecule in this case if i have observed the definition in this case it says that an element in one oxidation state is simultaneously oxidized and reduced so if i compare the oxidation number of oxygen in the case of h2o2 what i'll get if i consider the molecule h2o2 and i have to determine the oxidation number of oxygen in this case so this will be two times of h plus two times of oxy which is overall charge of zero therefore the oxidation number of hydrogen is fixed uh, in this case that is it is always one so 2 into 1 plus 2 into in this case i would consider as x because this oxidation number of oxygen is what i have to find out in per oxide in hydrogen per oxide so this will be given as two times of x will be nothing but minus 2 therefore x is equals to minus 1 so that means it is been observed that the oxidation number of oxygen which is present in an elemental form which is zero or which is present in a molecular form which is zero but in this case it is been found as minus 1 so therefore i could write the statement as the oxidation number of oxygen in h2o2 molecule is 1 minus or minus 1 but in case of product that we have got we have got the product as h2 and in this format as we know that the oxidation number of oxygen is always 2 minus when we have also got another product like o2 simply the oxidation number of oxygen in o2 is 0 so let us see whether the reaction is undergoing redox reaction or not if i have observed the oxidation number of h2o2 in this case i have got the oxidation number of oxygen as minus 1 and oxidation number of oxygen is minus 2 while in this case the oxygen oxidation number of oxygen atom is 0 so basically this minus 1 is been converted into minus 2 this will only happen if electron is been accepted means in the same reaction this oxygen atom is been reduced as well as in the same reaction this oxygen atom is been oxidized from minus 1 to 0 so hence this kind of reaction is known as disproportion reaction i hope you have got an idea that what is disproportionation reaction let me give you an another example so that it will clarify you and give you more detail about how and what is disproportionation reaction so in this thing i have mentioned that the copper plus iron is been converted into cu2 plus plus copper so the oxidation number of copper in this case is 1 as we can observe while in this case is Two and while in this case because there is no charge present on this uh, elemental form of copper, so it is zero. So this copper is been converted into Cu two plus by increasing the oxidation number from one to two plus. So therefore, this is known as oxidation reaction. While the same is been converted into zero oxidation number, which means it has accepted electron and hence it is showing the process of reduction. so the same element is showing different oxidation in a reaction and has this kind of reaction are known as disproportionation reaction 
So we have taken two examples to clarify whether this uh, kind of reaction and how can we determine the oxidation uh, and reduction uh, followed by the atoms that can show different uh, oxidation number by an, of an element. So I hope you have uh, got an idea. So thank you friends for watching this video and please share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.